Hi everybody, it's Miss Carol. You know me. I'm here to give you a pajama story time. But before we get started, I just want to remind you, and remind everybody that tomorrow at 4.30, Mrs. Sullivan is going to be doing a craft. And these are the supplies you are going to need. You're going to need a sock. You're going to need scissors. You're going to need two to three rubber bands or headbands, hair bands I should say, uncooked rice or beans, yarn, string or twine, a piece of ribbon, markers, and a cup or funnel. All right, so any one of those things, you need all those things to help make the craft. And again, that's tomorrow with Mrs. Sullivan at 4.30. Now, I wish I could be with you guys, but it is what it is. So here I am sitting in my backyard. You might see my crazy dog run by. Um, but let's get started with our story time. You guys ready? All right. We're going to do our hello song. So we're going to clap, 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 a clap, and a clap, and a clap, and a clap. Hello, everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Hello, everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, my darling. Oh, that was excellent. That was so excellent. Oh, you guys are phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. All right. Now, I have to ask you, I, I, I know it's been a while since you've been to the library. You didn't forget your parts, but can you guys point to your heads? I, I, I think this is still it, right? This is the head, and then you have your, your shoulders, and then I'm going to stand up a little bit, and knees, and way down there, your toes, and oh, wait, what's next? Oh, eyes, and your ears. Did you find your ears? I hope you have, you still have two of them? I do, I think I do and your mouth and your nose wait that doesn't seem right no nose 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 no that's the head nose where's the nose where oh the nose is right there i got you now okay you guys ready head shoulders knees and toes knees and toes Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Well, that was fun, but I, I think we could go faster. You ready? Because you know me. I have the need for speed. So you ready? Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Did you do it? I can go fast. Are you ready? Want to watch? Head, shoulders, knees. Done. Ta da All right. Excellent job. Did you find all your parts? I hope so. All right. Our first story, speaking of parts, is called Parts. And this book is brought to you today by Scholastic. Parts. I just don't know what's going on or why it has to be. But every day it's something worse. What's happening to me? I think it was three days ago I first became aware that in my comb were caught a couple of pieces of my hair. I stared at them, amazed and more than just a bit appalled to think that I was only five and starting to go bald. Then later on, I don't recall exactly when it was, I lifted up my shirt and found this little piece of fuzz. I stared at it, amazed and wondered, what's this all about? But then I understood, it was my stuffing coming out. Next day, when I was outside playing with the water hose, I saw that little bits of skin were peeling from my toes. I stared at them amazed, and then I gave a little groan to think that pretty soon I might be peeled down to the bone. Then yesterday, before my bath, as I took off my clothes, a chunk of something gray and wet fell right out of my nose. I stared at it, amazed and thought, I should be feeling pain. Well, wouldn't you, if you just lost 
a little piece of brain. So now today I'm sitting here enjoying Dr. Seuss and suddenly I realize a tooth is coming loose. I wiggle it. I'm raised, dismayed, too horrified to speak. Without my teeth, how can I eat? Already I feel weak. Now I'm really worried. I'm as scared as I can be because finally what's happening is very clear to me. The glue that holds our parts together isn't holding me. And now I'm thinking to myself, what's next in line to go? Might be my ears, might be my eyeballs. How's a kid to know? One day I might be playing ball and have my arm fall off. Or maybe I could lose my head if suddenly I cough. Quite soon I'll be in pieces in a pile without a shape. Thank goodness dad keeps lots and lots and lots of masking tape. What? You forgot to tell me teeth fall out? And when they do, some brand new teeth will soon begin to sprout. My hair, my skin and everything. There's nothing I should fear. So all of me is normal. Phew, that's really good to hear. Then tell me, what's this yellow stuff I got out of my ear? And did you guys like that one? I hope so. That's one of my favorite books. It cracks me up every time. Do you guys need to stand up? Because, you know, I need to stand up. You guys ready? Do you know where your hands are? Do you know where your feet are? Hands, feet. I got me in my pajamas. I'm nice and cozy here. You ready? You put your right hand in, you put your right hand out. You put your right hand in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your left hand in, you put your left hand out. You put your left hand in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. You put your right foot in, you put your right foot out. You put your right foot in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Uh huh. You put your left foot in, you put your left foot out. You put your left foot in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. You put your whole self in, you put your whole self out. You put your whole self in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. Whoa, you guys were great. I saw that. Well, I wish I could. All right, we got another story. You guys ready for another one? This one is called Moose Tracks. And this is also brought to you today by Scholastic. I have to say that. One thing I'm fairly certain of, last night, those tracks were not there. There was a bear hair on my lawn chair, but a bear came by to eat. When we barbecued our supper, he shed hair there on the seat. Bear hair, I remember. But who left all these moose tracks? There are moose tracks in my kitchen, and I'm itching to know why. Some friends dropped over yesterday, but not one moose stopped by. There are nutshells on the counter, but a chipmunk left them there. He was making nut fudge sundaes, mm -mm -mm, for the two of us to share. Nutshells, I remember, but who left all these moose tracks. There are moose tracks on the den floor. How they got there, 
I can't say. Last night, there were no, no moose tracks, and they're everywhere today. There are feathers on my carpet, but my best pal is gone, a goose. We were playing hokey pokey, and her feathers fluttered loose. Feathers, I remember. But who left all these moose tracks here? There are moose tracks in my bathroom. It's an all-out mystery. If I only knew who left them, he could mop them up for me. There are moose prints in my bathtub, but my maid, she is a mouse, and she's always leaving wee prints when she tidies up my house. Mouse prints, I remember. But who left all these moose tracks? There are moose tracks in my bedroom. They are spattered all around. Noisy moose feet should have clattered, but I never heard a sound. There are wood chips in my grass bed, but a beaver spent the night. He got hungry and the bedpost looked so good he took a bite. Wood chips, I remember. But who left all the moose tracks? Who on earth left all these moose tracks? I'm quite sure I'll never guess. Why, look at me. I am a moose. And I don't make a mess. That's lucky. The end. I hope you guys like that one. All right. You guys, let's see, should we stand up? Should we sit down? Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh, let's stand up again. All right, you ready? No, let's sit down. No, stand up. Okay, 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 okay. All right, here we go. You ready? We're gonna sing a little song before our goodbye song. You ready? You're gonna clap, 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 clap. And then you're gonna stamp, 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 stamp. Okay, all right. Because what we're doing is when you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. When you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. When you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. When you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. When you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. When you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. When you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. When you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet. When you're happy and you know it, pat your knees. When you're happy and you know it, pat your knees. When you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. When you're happy and you know it, pat your knees. When you're happy and you know it, rub your tummy, yum, yum. When you're happy and you know it, rub your tummy, yum, yum. When you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. When you're happy and you know it, rub your tummy, yum, yum. When you're happy and you know it, shout, hooray! Let me hear you. Oh, I heard you. When you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! When you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. When you're happy and you know it, shout hooray! All right. Did you guys have fun? I hope so. I miss you guys. I hope to see you really soon. Like now. But until then, we'll see you soon. All right? So we're going to do our last song. And I want everybody to put your hands up in the air. I'm going to sit down because I'm going out of camera range here. I'm also losing my chair here. All right, you ready? Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. And I was accompanied by Lucky. That's how it goes sometimes. You guys have a very good night. Go to sleep now, please. Miss Carol says go to sleep. So go to sleep. I'm going to go to sleep. It's the middle of the day right now, but I'm going to go to sleep soon. You guys have fun. I'll see you guys soon, okay? Bye, miss you.